40. Stable at step three. Twenty-five. Status check. Go Atlas. Go Centaur. Go Maven. Twenty. Fifteen. T minus ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Main engine start. Ignition and liftoff of the Atlas V with Maven, looking for clues about the evolution of Mars through its atmosphere. Mark, everything looking good. Still at 100% rate of thrust on the RD-180. Vehicle rates are looking good. We do have roll program in, right as expected. We're actively controlling mixture ratio. Valve position looks good. Thrust regulator valve position looks good. Speeds are good. And vehicles operating as expected. Continue uh, down the center of the range track. Everything is looking good. We're now 1.6 nautical miles in altitude. 1.1 miles downrange, traveling at a little over 1,000 miles per hour. And we have ended our program, yaw roll programs. Everything is looking good, continuing at 100% thrust. And we are now passing through the sound barrier. Maven is now supersonic. RD-180 continues to operate at 100% rate of thrust. We are about to pass through Max-Q. And vehicles passing through Max-Q, rates look good. Engine continues to operate at 100%, and we have throttled down to 95% thrust right on time. And we are now 10 nautical miles in altitude, 7.4 miles downrange, traveling at 2,200 miles per hour. And everything is looking good, continue to operate at 95% thrust. Coming up on our next mark event, I expect to enable Q-Alpha steering. And steering's enabled. Body rates look as expected for bringing in steering. Vehicle is now 50% of its liftoff weight. And we're about to fire the pyro valves to activate the second stage reaction control system. Pyro valves have fired. System has pressurized. And the RD-180 continues to operate as expected at 100% rated thrust, or 95% rated thrust correction. Rates are looking good. Continue to accelerate, passing through three Gs. PU control looks good. And continue to, flight, continue to fly right down the center of the range track. We are now 35 miles in altitude, 70 miles down range at 6,000 miles per hour. Reaction control system is now fully pressurized. And continuing to operate at 95%. Good PU control, smooth body rates, continue to have nominal acceleration. Vehicle is now 25% of its liftoff weight. We are now throttling the engine to actively control at 5 Gs. We have started boost phase chill down. Housing temps are reacting as expected. We continue to operate the RD-180 as expected. We are now flying a 4.6G throttle profile. Engine is throttling, getting ready for booster engine cutoff. We do have, we have Beco coming up on staging. We have stage separation. 
Everything is looking good. We have pre-start on fuel and locks. Everything's looking good. Ignition, full thrust. Since our main engine is up at 100% rated thrust, coming up on fairing separation. We have fairing set. And rates look good for fairing separation. Should be cutting back in on closed loop control. And we've done purge firings in the reaction control system as expected. We do have closed loop control reestablished after fairing jettison. The RL-10 continues to operate as expected, nice and smooth. PU is in open loop control as expected. Axial acceleration is steady. We are now 93 or 107 miles in altitude, 426 miles downrange, traveling at 11,700 miles per hour.